Hello, beautiful. This is Reverend Jennifer Hadley. And as always, I'm deeply grateful that we're in prayer partnership together. And the power prayer for today is for receptivity. Mm, It's not a good one. And so let us tune in right now into the field of gratitude, opening our hearts and minds to gratitude, being grateful and thankful right now that we are invoking the grace of God. We're inviting it, allowing it to recalibrate us and restore us right now. We're grateful and thankful to shift our vibration into thanksgiving. So literally ratcheting up, calibrating up into this high field of vibration that is deeply and profoundly healing and nourishing, sustaining to our very being, to our spirit. We're grateful and thankful that the presence of divine loving intelligence is already one with us. We're already one with it. It's not far away and it's not someday in the future. It's right now. And we are receptive to an expanded awareness of our divinity and the wholeness that is our true nature. Oh, yes. We are receptive to this connection with the Holy Spirit. We are receptive to divine insight, guidance, and wisdom via the cosmic Christ. We're connecting in and receiving the divine download even now. We open our awareness to fully receive an awareness of the kingdom, and it's our true nature to accept it, to allow it, and we give thanks for that right now. Oh, yes, we're open and receptive to abundance. We're literally opening our heart and our mind to love, to prosperity, to all manner of divine good. Yes, creativity and divine ideas flowing into our mind. We're receptive to them. Oh, we are gratefully receiving healing right now. Mm. It is powerful, and I feel that it's good. And so right now we are claiming this dynamic healing in the areas of our finances. We're receptive to a healing. We're receptive to all kinds of healing in our relationships, our work relationships, family relationships, friend relationships, our relationship with ourselves, and our relationship with the Spirit. Yep, we are right now receptive to inspiration of all kinds and we share we share the benefits with all beings because we're one with them we share because we give from the overflow and we are grateful we are grateful we are grateful in deep gratitude we let it be and so it is amen Amen, amen, amen. Yes, receptive to divine grace, grateful for all that we are receiving even now, opening up the floodgates. See, I don't want to stop. (laughs) I'm grateful and I'm receptive, Mm, and I know you are too. And uh, let's see, talking about receptive, divine guidance the teleworkshop I'm doing Saturday morning, it's really about being more receptive to divine insight and guidance. And this has got to be one of the most helpful things uh, that I've ever, ever, ever received and been able to share in my life is an understanding of divine guidance. Intuition is really what it's all about. And uh, so often people get intuition and they just don't follow it. They don't quite grasp the difference that it makes in their life. And so they push the divine guidance away and it delays the, the clarity. It delays the opportunity. It delays, but, you know, it doesn't wipe it out. It just delays it. And so right now what I notice is most people want to get on the fast track. Most people want to wake up and smell the delicious coffee of divine inspiration. So 
that's what this teleworkshop is about. Saturday morning, 90 minutes on the phone. And you can register at jenniferhadley.com. Click through to the events page. Also, my Finding Freedom class starts Tuesday night, six weeks on the phone, 90 minutes. And uh, there was a special offer in my e-newsletter this week on Monday. If you saw it, I am going to send another e-newsletter with a final um, uh, offer in it so you can watch for that. And let me tell you, finding freedom, one of the main things that I notice is so many spiritual students, they have taken so many classes and read so many books but they aren't clear about what to apply, when to apply it, and they're not applying a lot of it, a lot of it. And they're spinning around. The information actually becomes clutter in their mind. And so finding freedom is really about uh, feng shuiing the mind, decluttering, and it creates this tremendous energy and momentum for people that turbocharges their life. It's really quite spectacular. When people get into the Finding Freedom class and take advantage of the support, really fly with the tribe, it's amazing the results that people have. It literally turns their life around and it opens their hearts and minds. They reclaim their joy and career openings, family openings, relationship openings, financial openings, all kinds of openings happen for people. And, you know, it it takes the support. It's not enough to read a book. It's not enough to take a weekend workshop. You really need to have the consistent support. So that's what's being offered here. And six weeks to really shift your patterns and habits so that you can live the life that you truly desire. And here's the thing, you take this class now, you will have a different experience in your family over the holidays through what can be for many a stressful time and start 2010 with a whole new vantage point. Doesn't that sound good? Mm, I'm excited about it. So please join me. If you need a payment plan, just ask me, jenniferhadley.com, click through to the events page, Finding Freedom. Much love to you this day. Thank you for calling and being in prayer with me. I so appreciate you. <laughs>